Hello guys, good morning, rise and shine. Welcome to RC Overdose X Diecast Collector. This is Dev coming to you. And today I will be reviewing and changing the rims on my Honda S2000. Now these guys are made by BNDS, custom wheel parts. It's 164 wheel and tire set. It comes with a set of rims, the set of rods, and also a set of rubber tires. All right guys, I'm very excited to change the pair on my Honda S2000. I have been looking forward to this particular pair since about uh, a month and a half, but it sometimes takes time because these things come all the way from China. However, guys, Honda S2000 is going to look awesome with these rims. So let's take them apart, guys, and uh, assemble them. I hope you enjoyed today's session. Like, share, and subscribe, and stay tuned for similar content. Let's get started. So let's open this up. Check it out here. First of all, guys, it comes with instructions. And uh, this is the most important part because you want to make sure you guys have this one in front of you when you're assembling this. So the first thing is you have to carefully cut out the pieces. Then you have to carefully remove any excess, remove all the dust and oil from parts prior to cement, which means prior to assembling it. And then also you can paint it black if you want. I'm not going to do that. And also put a dab of glue, put some glue on it, a little bit of glue on the sides, insert caps into the center hole, and assemble the wheels on the rubber tires, and then you're good to go. Details are just popping at me. So this is the interior of the rim that you're gonna have to cut from here and glue it to the centerpiece. And the tires, guys, they have deep dish, so the frame and the rim set will go in the centerpiece and it should look pristine. You guys can see it's made with precision. All right, and so this gives you a very close up look of the rims. So what you have to cut up is just on the top here with a knife. I will be using a small knife that I have, but uh, you can use precision tools that are available in the market. And let's peel this plastic off from here. Okay, so you guys can see that I have twisted this a little bit. So all you would need to do is put a little piece of knife and peel it off. Right, so these are taken off and they look pretty awesome guys. If you have a look, it shines very cool. And look at the details guys, it's how small this piece is. And the details are just out of this world. I love it and this is my first set to be honest. So first off, I will be installing the rod into the rim itself. You guys can see it. And we're gonna poke this down through. Let's try that out. Have a look at that glow, guys. The shine, the gold, and amazing, amazing set. I love it. So we have done all these steps already. Now it is time for step five. I'm gonna put a little bit of glue on the bottom, assemble the rim just the exact same way that it shows in the picture. And then I'll see how it looks and then I'll show you guys. This is a very small miniature piece so I'll be using crazy glue, very small drop and a toothpick to go around inside. So the rims are ready to rock and uh, guys I'm very very stoked I'm really stoked in the way they look and just the way it feels as well the, the, the part is a very good quality made part and I will be a regular customer for these guys because I mean I've had a lot of rims in the past but this is my first from this particular company BNDS and it's it's pretty cool okay this is the last part of the process um, in terms of assembly you have to put a little bit of dab of glue in here and insert it inside here so that will secure your rod and then you would have a proper roll-in. The rims are ready. Now we're gonna put the tires on them and slap them on the S2000. And while these guys are waiting for it to be glued on properly, let's uh, take the rims off of the S2000 and get this one ready for its new pair.
All right, so with that being said, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video and got some information that you needed. If you guys have any questions regarding the set of rims or anything, the die cast nature or RC's nature, please let me know down in the comment section. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Enjoy our Saturday, guys. Stay tuned for similar content, and God bless you all. Peace.